Champions League, and lending the title. Well, all of the dignitaries and the greats have turned out. Raul and Butraguena up in the president's box. They'll be envious of the players who are taking to centre stage at the Camp Nou this evening. It is, of course, a two-legged affair. They play again on Wednesday night in Madrid, which is a 10 o'clock UK kickoff, 11 o'clock at night, local time. What do you make of that one, Terry? Well, I think we have to make our own mind up. If it happens, it looks like it's increasingly likely to happen. Let's see who brings to Barcelona. Number, another number in the midfield in terms of their squad numbers. A few players, I think, that will be departed. There he is, the pantomime villain. Is it across goal? <laughs> I don't need to say anything, do I? You can hear who's coming on. And Barcelona making their change as well. It's uh, Karim Benzema. He's frequently taken out of the firing line. And he's going to rest his legs and Ronaldo will go. With the one goal lead away from home. Tony Kroos. Ronaldo. Fear in the hearts of Barcelona. Emergency action taken by Gerard Piquet. Well, he finished last season explosively, Cristiano Ronaldo, with 16 goals in his last 10 matches. The star of the Champions League final. So that's 33 next winter. His powers are not exactly waning, as he we are going to have to invest to appease the supporters. Gareth Bale's cross. <laughs> he knew exactly what picture he wanted to see on the front page of the Sports Dailies tomorrow, Cristiano Ronaldo. It would have been typical, wouldn't it? The overhead, scissors kick. He didn't want to tap him. The bicycle kick from Ronaldo. Just gets the contact wrong, just comes off his shin. He doesn't hit the target. That's Graham Rakitic. Another coming together. Tony Cruz, Carvajal. And there's a sensor. Isco. Ronaldo, brilliant ball. Marcelo joins in the party. Ter Stegen standing strong. Becoming far more entertaining as the superstar's legs are tiring. Here's Cristiano Ronaldo's offside. All the celebrations, Cristiano. Not massive for hats given the penalty. It was one of those yellow card hat came about. I wasn't sure it was going to be for a dive for Suarez or a penalty. Ronaldo. Easy for Ter Stegen. Brilliant tackle from Danny Cabajal. Here's Isco. Has Cristiano Ronaldo still got the legs? Yes, look at him fly. Moves inside, Ronaldo! <laughs> Cristiano Ronaldo! He's in good shape. <laughs> That's typical, absolutely brilliant. Turning defence into attack, Real Madrid, in the blink of an eye. And you wondered whether Ronaldo still had the pace to get away from Gerard Piquet. He did. And he's just waiting. You know exactly what he's going to do. Takes the touch. Here we see Barcelona in the attack. Rakitic misses the chance to take on the shot. And immediately Real Madrid break. Ronaldo into his guard. Return pass. And from here, it's a clear sight and goal for Ronaldo, is it? Cuts inside on his right foot. The power, the accuracy, right into the top corner. To Stegen at full length. What did you say? Three days, four days training? He certainly doesn't need any work on his finishing. <laughs> 30 minutes he was given tonight by Zidane. 10 minutes longer than against Manchester United. And it hasn't taken him long to get on the sheet. We're still getting in shape for the season. He's only had three practice sessions. I think he's been following the uh, 
the scientists and the fitness guru's recommendations puts us all to he should be booked for that exposing himself shouldn't he taking the shirt off gareth bale tired comes off given that 10 minutes break vasquez the ever willing substitute comes on he played 50 games last year lucas vasquez 30 of them as a replacement but bale will be kept fresh for wednesday night not a lot of recovery time as the drama finished a lot of hype about transfers in the summer this is a game that needs no hype it's cristiano ronaldo he goes nose to turf he's got a penalty oh no <laughs> he thought he had a penalty behind you cristiano he was booked for taking his shirt off and now he's being booked in the eyes of the referee for taking a dive and then we do see it a quite significant push by Ronaldo on the referee. It's been action-packed, hasn't it? We came on with 60 minutes gone. A bit of everything from Ronaldo. Well, two yellow cards and the goal. He thought he'd won the penalty. He turned around and Titi certainly made a contact with him. And Ronaldo's legs gave way. He may argue in his defence that his momentum took him over. Well, he will argue in his defence, I think there's sufficient contact there from Antiti, who does not, doesn't make any contact with the ball. Now to his goal side of the Barcelona defender, there's a push on the back, and you see the push from Ronaldo on the referee. It might it be a further issue as well. Was it three minutes between his sensational goal, getting booked for taking his shirt off, and we were joking about that, and then the referee, I think he had his card in his pocket before... Cristiano Ronaldo did make contact with him. What a cameo appearance that has yeah, been by Cristiano the, Ronaldo. The replay there, and you break it down, I think the initial contact from Antiti is outside the box. Well, this is a game that divides supporters. Two players who divide supporters as well. Joe Messi and Ronaldo that, both on the score sheet. Ronaldo dismissed. Ten man Real Madrid. Whichever way you look at that, Rob, I don't think it's a dive from Ronaldo.